Welcome back. Uh, I'm here at the gate to the Elven Gardens district. Uh, last time I just rushed through this uh, market district to do a lot of shopping because uh, I was uh, was trying to leave the the city. Um, I was getting a bit greetings, my Dunwell brother. Ah, greetings. I was, I was getting a bit uh, impatient because uh, I don't want to make the same mistake as again where I tried to go from Tatenhall to Imperial City and I got caught uh, like halfway through and it already was dark. So I want to leave, I want to leave in, um, in time so that I can, I can get there before nightfall. It's a bit strange though because Gerelden. Having never been in, been in the Imperial City before, he, he can't really help but... He can't really rush through because there's so many things to see to see here. The Imperial City looks very different than the, the cities in Morrowind. All these big blocky stonework made by the aliens. He only has... Uh, very little understanding, or a little histori historical knowledge about the about the imperial city, but he, he knows that they were built um, by the aliens a long time ago. Hello. How do you do? Oh, let's see. There's some new news board here. How do you do? Yes. Daedra more. Po more ah, Daedra. Daedra worship more popular than Somerset Isles. According to the latest Empire's documents about Somerset Isle, there is an increase of Daedra worshipping in the land of the Altmer. See, if only you could get there, that could be interesting. Oh, well, it's, it's off the map. It's way off the map. map. Smash. It's an apt name. Well, that would be Some pretty cool. Is a big um, killing should I get some so lunch? King and Queen Tavern. Sure. Sounds What's nice. I'm just gonna get a spot of lunch before heading out. This sounds like a good day. Good to know. Uh, good day. Like a tavern. Yes. I offer the finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. Watermelon wine. Let's get some wine. A lavish feast. Uh, I wouldn't make that deal with just anybody. White bread, beef, and some. An egg. You drive a hard. Tell your friends about me. Well, he has a lot. Let's see about the city. A wealthy city. gentleman in the Talos Plaza district named Umbacano collects alien artifacts. Perhaps he has use for someone like you. Alien artifacts? Huh. Goodbye. Well, that certainly... Hello there. Oh, I'm going to sit over here. Good afternoon. Rosan is Throne. the smith. One of the best around him, yes. Me. Oh, so that's... I never really had a good look at this sword before. Which is it? Old Norland. Um, let's get something to eat. Beef, bread, egg. And watermelon wine. I've heard she'll teach her skill. Uh, but so yeah, the... Um, I understand the Fighters Guild is hiring new members. This Umbecano. Did I get a quest about this? No. Nope. How do you do? This... I heard others say the this is definitely How something... Do you know? um, complain about the merchants in town? Berelden is interested in elite artifacts. Jumps like a toe. Any type of jumps. magical artifacts. If, if they're just of historical value or something like that, and there's no magic about it. Ah, it doesn't really interest him that much. I mean, he, of course, if it's worth a lot of money, then of course he'll he'll tell it, take it and and sell it. 
but he's not. Uh, that's not really where where his interest lies. He wants to he wants to get the magical stuff. But I'm actually I'm, I'm a bit of a, a bit of a pickle. I have less than five hundred gold coins left. Might be uh, I might be throwing around my my symptoms a bit too much. Ow. <laughs> He's a mystic. Uh, but yeah, I need to I need to make some. Let's make some gold on my way to coral. So I'm going to. Oh, by the way, oh yeah, I have a mod which removes the the crosshair, the keystroke. I quite like it. So to sort of minimize the any anything in the GUI. Wow! Look at that guy. I've heard that others is say the same. Anyone looking for one hell of an armor. Greetings to you, He's like a holy warrior. So Windicator. Alright, well, I'm at the city gates. I can see them. Well, let's head out before it gets too late. But yeah, that on Bocano. Maybe I should visit him later. I guess these are the horses for the these imperial soldiers. And maybe they can't uh, let me help them. Sometimes the guards they can't climb onto the horses if they are on a steep hill. Oh, wait, he's just leaving. Okay, he doesn't care about the horses. All right. Ah, look at that. All forts dotted around the landscape. Over there as well, reminding us of the glorious past of the Imperial the Imperials. Time is it? I was just gonna check. Four, almost five p.m. Uh, well, that's too late. Hmm. Ah, you know, I can um, just had an idea. I can, uh, I can, since I want to try to earn some money. Before I get to Coral, I can just uh, see if I can uh, investigate one of these forts, maybe. And then, after I'm done, after I've found some fat loot, I can uh, I can just spend the night there, and then I'll leave in the in the morning, so that I won't have to travel by night again. I, I really don't want to do that. That's just that's. It's too dangerous. I'd have to like constantly be recasting this um, night eye spell to to be able to see anything. <laughs> and if I get caught out by something, some monster, then it's not very easy to fight them in the dark. And some of them you definitely do not even want to run into. You want to see them from a distance and then avoid them. <laughs> Especially that last uh, oh there, the harbor. Those undeads, they were really, really tough. That was definitely high-level creatures. Ah, here's an another another option just presented itself. The Relda noticed this. This. Uh, this tiny sleepy village here. 
Hello. Um, and what looks like an inn because there's stables there, so I could just sleep here for the night. You know, I think I'm going to warn it in. I think I'm going with my initial idea. I'm going to get. I'm going to find the closest fort, and then I'm going to see if I can um, go all the way through it and get some loot. And I'm going to sleep there. And if not, I'm going to head back to this inn, the Warned Inn, in this tiny little village, and spend the night. Check my. This is the most important. Ten healing, ten normal, three strong, and six of the weak. Oh, by the way, I also have have to remember this. I have eight minor uh, heal minor wounds, and they they are not quite as good as potions because if you get hit, if you're in, a, in a middle of combat and several people are fighting you. And you get hit just as you cast the scroll, uh, yeah, just as you use the scroll. Then the the spell just sort of fizzles, fizzles out. It doesn't work. And that's no good. But a a potion. It's different. It doesn't require an action. You just you are in the menu, so you can just click it and instantly use it. So it's it's even better. Yeah, the sun is about to go down. Behind those trees, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start running. I'm gonna investigate this ruin right here, this old fort ruin. Well, let me check this. Morning glory. Don't remember what they do. Fortify sneak. Damage speed. Ah, lavender. Lavender is good. I need lavender for the restore fatigue. All right. Let's see. How do I? Better get my weapon out. By the way, how is my armor? What did I? Oh yeah, I remember. I bought this um this gauntlet curious greaves. Hundred and twenty seconds. So that's like one one fight. But it's um it's a kind of a cool idea. This um oh now look at this this is maybe a pyre once or maybe this is like for signaling to the next fort they've put some fire here a small pyre and then they they can signal the next fort wait the real then gets. A nasty feeling. Whoa! Whoa! Where the heck did that come from? Huh. That really startled me. This is sitting up here. Where the heck? Oh. Maybe it's because this stone uh, color. This gargoyle. They actually fooled me. Ooh! I'm still in combat. There's something nearby. Garellan feels it. Oh, I think there's something down here. Let me let me cast something. Oh, it's these small uh, wa walks. What are they called? Walks. Wow! Walk. Huh. 
it's like um, it's like uh, angry puppies or something. Wog. Wog skin. <laughs> oh. Little you. You're way too aggressive for your size. There's no business attacking someone ten times your size. Alright, I'm going to save here. Oh, by the way, maybe I should... Uh, how much health did I lose? Two... Should I... Top off with this one? Yeah. Just gonna heal up here and then I'm going to save and then I'm ready. To enter this fort. Let's see what's what's in here. Shouldn't be. I shouldn't be having a, a light spell active on me right now. That's not a good idea. Uh, I thought I could use this anti magic to dispel my own, but I can't dispel this. Mm, all right, all right, all right. What do I do then? Oh, I have this one. I just depleted my magicka. Gonna have this one active. I see how it works. I haven't really detected anything yet. Superior magic item detection. 80 feet. Um, what was. Oh, it's five. I'm gonna sneak. Alright. So, I'm thinking it's a bit like. Um, uh, what's it called? Major life detection, like life detection, where you can see through walls and see stuff. Whoops! Is that a guy? I think there's someone here. Was it dog? Clad in armor. And nothing is being detected. Oh, it sees me. Hound dog. Huh. This brain. Ah, hot. Yeah, that's a problem. Um, Berildan is not really... He's not good at opening gates, because... The normal way you do it is... Well, if you're sort of a thief-like guy, you can use security. And that works great, if you have a lot of lockpicks. Uh, but uh, or you can cast alteration to open. Sp I can't do that either. So that means there's only one way, and that's brute force. I have to smash. But in order to do that, I have to. I'm going to have to destroy my own weapons. That is not really something I am keen on doing. Okay, I'm gonna try this anyway. What's in there? Is there even a chest in here? Oh, there's one chest. Let's see over here. A chest over there. All right. I'm going to do it. Wah! Wah! 
Yeah. Hmm. I guess that wasn't too bad. Let me just check how much damage. 84. I guess maybe I can. Oh! 735, spell absorption, 45 and 30, yeah. That's more like it. I'm grabbing all of this. This is perfect. The other one only took three. Yeah. Let's see. Can I have a... 99 gold. That's perfect. Very good. Um, better sneak on. Needs to be full health. Well, if there's a dog in here, actually, I think that only that means humans of some sort. Someone's fighting. I hear metal clanging against each other. Well, if people are fighting each other, I'm okay with that. Then I can collect the loot afterwards. Well that, that's perfect. Oh, there's some guys over there. They just killed this guy. Three guys just killed that guy. Oh! Did they just... I think they just saw me. Uh... Oh, maybe I can summon this... Can I summon it down this hole? Let me try. Yeah! Ha! <laughs> this is perfect. Fight them! Ha! <laughs> Can I summon? Ah, yeah, let me try this one. Ah, there it is. Disembodied skull. Is this a funny spell? Oh. Uh, more. Wah! I got hit with an arrow. See anything? Where are they? Wow, there's like three archers over there. Wow! This. Uh. Whoops, wrong button. Uh. How are you going to approach them if they're just turning three? They're firing arrows, but I only see one. Okay, I'm going to. Oh, that's why. Let me heal up and engage. Engage the enemy. Come here, skeleton. All right, you two guys, you get in front. Ah, that's a skeleton. My, my my head. Whoa. Move. Move. Today you die. Ooh. 
Almost dead. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, fight him. Yes. Oh. I think we got them all. What is this place and why is it underwater? Um, mm, here. I need some more light. Wow, there's a lot. Look at all these bodies. A Bosma seagull bucket. Hmm. Uh, well, I can't. I can't carry all of this. That's for sure. I'm going to. I'm going to have to just. Be a bit selective. That's ah, a short sword. I want a long, longer one. Bandit Bowman. Old Poignard. That's probably a short way. Not steel hill. Mm, no, it's light. Oh, this is a jeep. Bronze helmet. Uh, no, don't want that one. Marora. Squire sword. That might be something. Marora. Ah, look at that helmet. Looks pretty mean. Marora Greaves. Gauntlets. Oh, I can actually check it out before I... Mm. I'll grab the gauntlets. I can't really see. Drawing shield. Drawing shield. Sick. Oh, it's worth a lot. No, I'm already carrying too much. Gauntlets, creeps. Hmm. Okay, I really have to uh, be very selective. Oh, it looks strange, this little squire sword. Oh, that looks very high quality. Look at that. That looks... Oh, that's something that... Uh, this one is longer. Oh, that's my skeleton head. Alright, I have to drop some of this. This one... Leather. Hmm. Oh, eight... Um, oh, yeah. I have to check this out. Gauntlets. Are they really... Hmm. These are damaged. I have to drop those. Wait. And there's a chest as well. Rotten chest. Aurora Greaves. Ah, look at that. Greaves, gauntlets. Curious boot. Night bastard. Let me just. I'm just gonna pretend that. My head is over the water. <laughs> I'm actually drowning, <laughs> but I just want to have an have an idea what it looks like. This is heavy armor. No, it's only the one. It's only one arm. What? How is this possible? This. Okay. Hmm. I think. It's too bulky, it's too much of a warrior type, there's too much going on here, I don't really... No, this is, this does not fit the style. Night, oh, it's a two-hander. Yes, that's too 
heavy. Gotta drop some more stuff. Uh, this. All oh, this Marauder. Stuff. Gotta go. And. Wait, what am I? I'm carrying away too much. Uh, Marauder gauntlets. Greaves. Ah, oh, here we go. Now I can. Night sword. Wait, night sword? Some of these are like expert. Um, this um, normally it's hundred percent or hundred. Hundred means it's fully repaired. But then if you have this skill, you can repair them beyond, so that you are sort of perfecting them. And this has been perfected, so they have higher value than than normal. Uh. Squire sword, knight sword. Knight sword, ah, this one is the. Okay. So I gotta. Yeah, these are equally good. A knight sword on old Norland. Wait, old Norland weighs a lot less. Gonna have to take that one. There's a bit of a problem when you can't carry that much. <laughs> have to. <laughs> To spend a lot of time fiddling with this. Ah, Marauder helmet. I want to check that out. Although, no. Okay, drop that. Um, drop that. Ah, here maybe we have some treasure. Ah, yes, damage intelligence. Yeah, they can take someone down. Oh, this one is super expensive. His bow. I'm taking that one. Dropping this one. Oh, this uh, restore health. <laughs> this skeleton is following me. Um, let me just unsummon you. Oh, something up here. I didn't check it. Better save, so I don't have to do all of this again. This might be a bit uh, boring to watch, actually. <laughs> <laughs> having to roam through all this but it's absolutely necessary I, I can't just take some stuff and then I, I can't just I don't have a chance to just come back and forth all the time it's a very far to the next um, merchant yep over in combat well I can repair stuff Yep, that was enough. Wow, stuck here. I'm going to get around this way. It should be. I should be perfectly safe now. What's in here? It's nothing. No traps or anything here. No, it's just. And below half health. These healing potions I have, they are not really. They're definitely not very strong. We check. Oh, a statue without a head. A chest. Ah, 
But I think it has given me more than a thousand gold, I think, from going in here. The found that um, potion worth seven seventy-five. Uh, that's that's a lot. Well, I can probably only sell it for like half, but still, so very good for a single item. So yeah, this is the end. Two chests and a barrel. Oh. Fight it. One of these mimics. What? Oh, it's in the... <laughs> it's inside the, the wall. It bugged out. Ah, got it. It unbugged itself. Ooh! Okay, shield. Oh, yep. Ah. Oh, in combat. Ah, I have to drop something. Gotta drop this. Okay. And then. A beer barrel. Well, okay for that. Oh, 1k. That means there's a, a little bit above, probably thousand. We can see 1280. So this was almost 1200. Great maze of embers. Oh, it's too heavy. I want to just gonna check it out. Ah, okay, yeah, but this is just too heavy. Someone has been using it, so only it's not fully charged. Oh, can't drop it in here. All right, so I'm done with this fort. I got quite a got quite a lot. I think I'll just. What time is it? Wow! Spent all night here. All right, I'm get I'm get a few hours sleep, and then I'm off. I should be able to make it to to Coral from here. Wow! Look at my health. I was so beat up that I didn't even fully restore. I only got a little bit. All right. Well. I have to just use some more healing potions and get me some breakfast. Rye bread, ginseng, meatloaf. Let me check out. I want to see my orcish sword. This is the dwarven. Really like that one. Orcish. Shield, ah, not sh sword, shield. See, this fits my character. Yep, he's keeping that one. And it looks way better than this. Yeah, this one. Uh, where's my, ah, uh, yeah. That's the look. Now we're leaving. Spooky background music. This fort. The guard dog died. Well, I guess there was like two competing factions in here. So the marauders, and then bandits. Two different factions.
Come on. It's really slow to save. Ah, maybe it's because I have so many save games in that folder now. It's raining. But, yeah. This is... it's not even noon. Well, actually, it's just past noon. But I only have to make it this small trip. Oh, there's a little... Ah, maybe the bandits camped out here. And then they went inside to have a look. And found... Death. I guess I'll just... Go up here. Walk through the... Wet grass, which isn't very nice, especially this tall Berlin pants are just really wet. Why is there a horse on its own? With a set, I'm not sure what that is. It's a humanoid, but it didn't look particularly human. Is that? Hmm. Maybe I should just keep walking. Not worry too much about it. But that looks like a Imperial Legion horse. So maybe there's something strong enough to defeat an Imperial Legion uh, soldier. That's not that's not good news for me. Well, I have my. Tremora. My scam. Uh, well, by the way, so I have to do. Uh, I have to do two things. I have to. Uh, I have to join the Mages Guild when I get to Coral, and I have to. I have to buy some some expert level summon spells. Hopefully they have that in coral. Whoops. Oh that's a Marauder, isn't it? Oh He poisoned him. That was very fortunate for me. That I was not the one getting all that poison on me. Wow, what a sandwich. Just got three man this bandit. Scales curious, what's this? Probably light, yeah, it's light. Bruma shield. Oh, look, what's that kind of weapon? What's that? Yeah, can pull him. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to work out if it's, if it's something worth taking. Iron curious. Let me just check this. Mm. No. It's badly damaged. That was just it was just one. Usually they they attack in pairs, don't they? What's that? Ah, that's a, just a traveler. An archer. Oh, hello. Hello. She's not afraid. There's another one. Ah, another archer. Yes. Judy Miss. Pretty steep hill. 
All right. So, so from what uh, Berildin uh, was led to understand, it was uh, was explained by this um, this mage at the university was that he has to. He couldn't join while he was at the university. He had to join when he was at one of the local chapters. So this is a. Uh, Obviously, Berlin just thinks this is a waste of time, because he has a, he's a a well-known mage in the, in the mages guild in Morwind, and in uh, Vivek at least. He's obviously known for his, uh, his mysticism and, and and conjuration. That's where he's he's been spending almost all his time, researching and. People know that he's good. Well, the mages know he's uh, very, very skilled. So now he comes here to Cyrodiil and finds that that they demand he has to go to a a town just in order to join. He'd hoped you can just join automatically. Huh? What kind of spell is that? I don't understand what these spells. Sometimes they cast Young Troll. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna cut the fat from him. Don't have time for that. Ah, look at this overgrown place. So this was probably once. I could imagine this was. Um, like a tax collecting place. There's a gate all the way through it. Or maybe it's here for defense just. But this would be a good place to collect taxes. What's that? Oh, stop reading. Oh, you can enter here. There was a, there was a monster here. There was something running here. Oh, there's a bandit. Ah, look at this. Look how green it is here. Oh. There's something here. But look at the scenery. Is there something here? Looks like it's detecting something. Oh, it's a small spider. This modicus spider spawn. Uh -huh. Alright, let me see my uh, summon skull. I want to see it in action. Come on, spot them. I can't see them with this tall grass. You find them. Over here. Wow! It's running away. Something there. Just killed something over here. Ah, it's another spider. Spider cell, fortify sneak. I think I had another thing that was fortify sneak. Well, there's a mill. Windmill. Alright. Oh, what are these? Uh, Take a little, I don't remember. Oh, here, Lily Nectar. Fortify speed, damage health. I don't really. Fortify speed might be good. I don't really think Pereldin is much of a, a poison user. I don't really. It's. I don't think I'm gonna spend too much time with that. 
I think it's mainly to heal in between combats. The way I've been using these healing potions, these weak healing potions that I've made myself, they're not really strong in a combat situation because they, they heal too slow. And... Um, uh, oh! These are good. What is fungus? Um, yeah, so it's better to just do something else. What's that? Well, almost, almost here now. Um, I think I think I should just save about here. Um, because I'm go I'm heading up to call now and. That's a that's a good place to stop, I think. Uh, next time I can um, I can um, enter and and do all the things that I need to do, sell some stuff. And I noticed that I made it before dark, although I think it is getting slightly dark now. What time is it? Seven, almost seven. Yeah, this is fine. I'll get inside the safety of the city gates before dark. So I think I'll just stop here. And next time it's inside call, see what that looks like. And what is this small chapel? Well, that's for another time. But uh, thanks for watching. And see you in the next one.